Welcome back. We might be feeling a little isolated in quarantine these days, but you don't have to. There's plenty of pet adoption agencies and shelters in the FM area that could use your help. So join us today. We've got Jill Frederick with Cat's Cradle Shelter. Jill, thanks so much for joining us today. Uh, Cat's Cradle, you know, it's closed right now, but are you guys still doing adoptions? Well, thanks for having me and thanks for asking. We are still doing adoptions by appointment. And I, was, I mean, you hear all these stories that you see a big rise right now, people going out trying to adopt pets. Are you seeing the same thing? I don't think we've seen a rise. We've kind of had a steady state, same as, same as we usually do, happily. I, I was going to say, but I'm, I'm kind of surprised to hear that. So if people do want to, uh, you know, reach out to you and start thinking about an adoption, what's the process for that with you guys? Well, we'd ask them to go to our website, catscradleshelter.org, and there's a, an item on our menu, how to adopt. We'd ask them to fill out the renter's application for our director who does the preliminary screening to uh, work through. She will, uh, as soon as she can, get in touch with those folks and uh, do a preliminary interview over the phone. Um, presumably, uh, if once they're accepted, then we will set up a time for them to come into the shelter where we can introduce them to the cats that we have available. And so how is that working amongst this COVID-19 situation? Are you doing different screenings? Um, how does that work? Well, it the screening is the same it's just a little backwards we we do the we do the interview before the um prospective adopter finds the cat we are maintaining social distances we're asking only one person to come in at a time not bringing the whole family okay. we're sanitizing all the areas where they might sit to do um to fill out forms um obviously people are masking up uh, if they so choose. And um, we are asking everyone, of course, to be sanitizing and washing their hands as they move from room to room. This is kind of an obvious question, but I'm assuming that you guys do only cats as far as adoption. And then how many cats do you currently have up for adoption? We do only do cats. Right now, in the shelter itself, we have, we're down quite a bit. We have only 17. We still have uh, quite a few in our foster homes some of them are kittens who are too young to come into the shelter uh if if folks don't find anyone in our shelter right now that that they like we also have a a group at natural pet center they can make an appointment with natural pet center to come in and see those or they can look online to see our foster cats and uh, we can set them up with a prospective visit with our fosters. Jill, we got about 20 seconds left. You wanna just give out your website one more time, please? Yes, our website is catscradleshelter.org or you can leave a message. We do monitor our phone at 701-356-7877. Jill, thank you so much. We appreciate it and uh, stay safe, okay? Thank you. Really appreciate coming on. Thank you very much. All right, stay Bye with now. us. We've got a lot more coming up right here on North Dakota Today.